Hey Libra, welcome back. And for those of you that are new, I am so grateful you're here. My name is Sam. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Cross watchers, I'm happy you're here as well. Who wouldn't love a Libra? We are going to get right into your reading. Um, Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus placement. That is who this reading is for. You know to always take what resonates. Um, it's a, not a one-to-one -one reading, but generally you will be drawn to certain messages. There will things, there will be things that stand out that are is resonating with your current situation. <clears throat> so always take what resonates. Head over and watch your rising, your moon, and your Venus placement sign readings. Additionally, for added messages and you know maybe some similarities. With that being said, I am giving away three free personal readings for the month of December. All I need you to do to participate in my monthly giveaways is go ahead and subscribe. New and returning subscribers, leave the word gift or gift emoji down below in the comment section of this reading and any reading you view of mine from now until the end of the month. Each month it is a different giveaway. At the end of each month, I will always remind those that participated to check the bell, little bell top right hand corner of everyone's YouTube homepage. Three people will be hearing from me this month. Look at this. Something is occurring in divine timing. Something is coming, someone is coming towards you and it's in perfect timing. Wow, warm embrace. The love you want is here. Libra, the love you want is here. There's someone coming towards you to support you. Someone coming towards you to create that solid foundation with you. The love you want is here for Libra spirit. I have Leo energy showing up. So I have within 7 to 14 days. There's two cards of timing here. So within 7 to 14 days. Or during the summer. That this is happening. And you do share a magnetic connection. So a soul connection. Equal attraction. For those of you that it's someone you already know, I feel, and that have been intimate with this person, it's amazing. You both desire to be together. All right, let's see. For my Libra spirit. It says middle of the season. Middle, a, middle of a season. So it could even be summer of 2025. I know I'm doing this in December 2024, obviously with my holiday decks. But someone is going to make a comment all the way to September, or summer 2025. I mean, it's going to come to you realistically when it's meant to come to you. But I'm giving a time frame here. And it does say middle of the season. So I'm going to say from now until the middle of summer 2025. All right, let's get it. But strongly, I'm picking up on fire energy. Surprise to that. I got to say, Libra, I feel someone is feeling like you are the one that got away. Spirit is saying to be patient. This is your, well, this isn't your energy, but, and well, you may have Sagittarius in your chart, but this is the energy that's falling because we're going to do your energy, their energy, the overall outcome. So it's like needing to be patient, taking time with yourself. Um, for some of you, you're going through deep healing, a deep rejuvenation. Their energy. You already know who this person is, Libra. Remember, the love you want is here. You already know who this person is. They're thinking about you. Hard nostalgia here is happening. 
They may even come towards you and give you a gift, Libra. But they're definitely thinking of you. The moon. Suffering in silence. Secrets that need to be revealed. Things that need to come to light. Like I said, this is a very romantic, fantasy-like connection. Ten of Wands. Now, you see how long the burdens have been... You've been carrying certain burdens. The struggles have been real. You see how you've been th going through a cycle of seriously test of faith. You see the snow accumulating here. But what happens when you peak the tip of the mountain? Automatically, it's the most magnificent breakthrough. It's downhill motion. Everything falling into place. Sometimes it says like, you know, you got to feel like you've hit rock bottom for it to be uphill. You know, then it begins to be uphill and look better. It look brighter. But it's like, it's the reverse. It's like peaking the tip of the mountain and getting excitement, getting excited for the downhill spiral, the downhill motion, snowball effect of things falling into place. So I do feel a difficult cycle closing here. And there's the moment, the aha moment of what you mean to this person. Depending on how much distance has been between the two of you, it's given a lot of time for this person to thank. It's given a lot of time for you to heal. Look at this. As I stated, there will be communication. There will be that breakthrough. Eight of Wands, 11-11. Cupid's arrows, known by some tarot readers. Let's get deeper, Libra. Four of Swords, like I said, I really feel like you've been at a pause within yourself. Maybe retracted, haven't been dating, haven't put yourself out there. Maybe even in some solitude type energy. Hermit energy, and that's okay. I really feel you're doing what makes you feel good and what makes you feel happy. Focusing on what makes you feel that self-love. Like I said, you're really rejuvenating your energy. Yeah, there's things that you've dealt with that have really made you feel defeated. This person is coming towards you, Libra. You may be at a distance from them, but what's happening is they're leaving troubled waters behind them. They're making their way towards you. And sometimes it, is, it does not happen exactly in the time frame you would like it to happen. But know that they're traveling towards you. Yeah. Their journey has been tough on them. They are standing back up, no doubt. But they're taking their time to get to you. They're feeling guarded because of things that they've been through. Not just you per se, just things in general that they've been through. Again, look at the accumulation of snow on their, their stems. King of Swords, I feel that they have some fear approaching you, Libra. Depending on how things went down, it's like they feel they see you as being very strong-minded, strong-willed. And I do feel that they fear approaching you. But they are missing you. They're going to take a leap of faith. It's almost like they don't care how much it takes how long it takes to do right by you, they're going to put in that effort. And where they may not have been on the same page as you, I don't want to say immature, but where they may have lacked moving forward in a relationship, I'll say it that way. Basically, I am picking up on immature energy. It's like once, once they approach you mentally, they've overcome those struggles. 
yes, they're taking a leap of faith in like that butterfly in the stomach type of way, maybe kind of like giddish about, you know, so excited to have you back in their energy. But mentally, they know what they want with you. All right, spirit. Final messages for Libra on who is coming towards them. All right, we'll take it. The Ace of Swords, like I said, confession, possibly an apology, knowing exactly what they want. This is divine guidance. This is alignment. I really feel it was a game of cat, cat and mouse. Sometimes you showed up, sometimes they showed up. It was, ne it was just misalignment all along. Overcoming their fears. Overcoming the power struggles. Overcoming heartbreak separately. Overcoming their fear of commitment. And coming towards you. Labor, you stand out. No doubt you stand out from the rest. All right, messages from this person to Libra. The love that Libra wants is here, Spirit. I fear you will never forgive me. Like I said, I, I feel some sense of fear in them to approach you. This is a destined partnership. So I am picking up on a soul connection. I did as soon as lovers came through. And this is from lifetime to lifetime. I love you today, tomorrow, and always. I was just a fool for not admitting it, Libra. They're reminiscing about the time that you've spent together. It brings a smile to their face. It helps them feel connected to you. All right. Let's do Scrabble tiles. I, A, P, E, W, F, L. All right, let me just do a couple more because I had so many repeats. All right, we have Y, G, O, N, and then the rest are repeats. All right, take what resonates. Leave the word gift or gift emoji down below in the comment section. Libra, anytime you want me to tune into just your energy, click on the link in the description box. It will take you over to my Etsy shop. I usually offer a variety of personal readings. Um, but for the month of December, I went down to just emergency readings so I can enjoy the holidays and spend extra love on my YouTube channel. Once I get through all of the November readings I accumulated through Etsy with the sale going on, um, which should be within the next couple days, I will do additional readings for my YouTube family. So much love and light, guys.